Conceive, believe, achieve. This is former UFC middleweight champion of the world, Michael Bisping. Paddy the Baddy here. You're listening to Combat Sports UK. And you're watching Combat Sports UK. Chris Simpson, Combat Sports UK, with your winner and the champ, Jordan Little. Can you talk me through that finish a little bit? Because I have absolutely no idea what happened there. Uh, yeah, so my opponent shot in on me. He's strong. I was trying to break his grip and it kind of just sunk in in that position. His head was just on the right position. Um, I wasn't exactly aiming for it, but when it was there and it was on, I just knew I had it. The last 12 months, 11 fights, I think it is. 13, 13, 13, 13 yeah. fights uh, yeah. in 11 months. Is this a bit of a, a reward at the end of it now? Yeah, definitely. Um, I, I've worked hard. Uh, I've got a strong team around me, great fighters, great coaches. I owe it to them and they let me keep fighting. So, you know, a lot of coaches might say you need to rest. Mine are allowing me to carry on and it's paid off. Yeah. Do you think that's something that's really important to keep yourself active and just to keep getting more experience and more cage time? Definitely. You know, you consider the fact that people will have a large break in between. In between. They'll, they'll go off their diet, gain weight. Uh, maybe not train as hard and they're not keeping their skills sharp where you know if you want to build a career like I'm looking at my teammate Christian Duncan he's you know 27 amateur fights gone pro undefeated pro and champion like I'm I'm looking at what he's done and I want to do the same so yeah building on that I was uh, I interviewed Chris um, at his cage warriors title defense um, is that someone that you really look up to and it really keeps you motivated oh 100% you know like Christian you know he's coming to the sport I'd say quite late compared to some and he's just stuck in um, fucking sorry uh, work rate is hard and high he's committed everything is on point and he's someone to look at and go alright he's doing it so I want to do it and he's a hometown boy yeah definitely uh, when, do you, when are you looking at getting that, that title defended um, I, I don't know I've got the fight in March on Cage Warriors Academy to think about I've got the, uh, the worlds to consider um, and after that I need to talk to my coach and see what he says it might be I defend this one it might be def I defend my rage bout um it might be that like I go pro. I'd like to hope I'm going pro yeah. soon, so we'll just see. Yeah, definitely. And then just last before I let you go, anyone else you'd like to say thank you to, coaches, sponsors, anything like that? Oh, yeah. Thank you to all my coaches. You know, they, they put so much work in. Thank you to my sponsor, uh, Ashley James Electrical. You guys have supported me so well. Uh, my family and my partner, you're all, you're all there keeping me going, so thank you. Yeah. Well, hopefully next time I interview, mate, it'll be in the pro ranks. Um, but no, thank you very much for taking the time to speak to me, Jordan. Thank you. Thank you. Take care. Cheers, guys. Thank you.